Hello everybody and welcome to Fresh Trends. Social media has reacted to the news of Casper reportedly getting married. So basically Casper's relationship with his baby mama was for character development. Hate how you could love someone without knowing that the significance of your presence in their life is to be a life lesson and help them grow then they become better people for their next another person went on to say maybe she couldn't forgive him and you wouldn't want to stay with someone who keeps reminding you of the wrong or how you have hurt him or her Casper University is reportedly getting ready to marry his childhood Sirat Polani this news has taken many by surprise particularly because Casper had announced in a previous interview not so long ago that he was practicing celibacy which means he wasn't dating anyone a supposed wedding invitation has been making rounds on social media this was shared by my paper Ndawa, indicating that kaspar and polani are set to tie the knot on march the 16th the unexpected revelation has sparked a flood of reactions from fans and users on social media platforms another person went on to say the very same people who she gave invites to are the people that would destroy this marriage clearly they are not happy for her why broadcast something that was meant to be private many are taking back by the news with one user pointing out the irony that polani who had merely seen kaspar as a friend during their childhood and possibly wouldn't have considered marrying him if he wasn't wealthy is now said to be his wife so others are saying polani was kaspar's childhood sweetheart others they're saying that polani was kaspar's friend and she didn't want to date him then but she has decided to date him now we don't know which one is the truth whether they were childhood sweethearts or they were friends nobody really knows about this at the moment for now this is just rumors but this user's comments suggest that one should not base their dating choice on financial stability or material wealth according to them if a person is not willing to be with you during your low points they may not deserve you at your best this one said kaspanyo was going to marry polani who friend zoned him during his childhood if he didn't have money wouldn't marry him moral of the story never ever date a lady based on the affordability if she can't date you at your lowest she doesn't deserve you at your highest another one said if kaspanyo verse didn't make it in life polani was going to friend zone him until he dies without letting him smash not even once another one went on to say they think that these two they actually make a cute couple this one said come to think of it they actually make a cute couple stay low key and keep your marriage private not everything needs to be shared on social media and lastly put god first best of luck to you guys in an earlier development during a detailed conversation with podcaster Mpumeli Dwaba Kasper opened up about his personal life particularly about his relationship with Tobega the mother of his child he admitted that their breakup which happened two years ago, was largely due to him cheating. Kasper revealed that he had hurt Tobega deeply and that his actions led to the end of their relationship. Reflecting on his behavior, Kasper confessed that his approach to relationships with women was not healthy. He went on to say, I hurt my baby mama so much. We broke up. I've been single for two years, by the way. We broke up because I hurt her and then I just carried on living this life. She got saved, which is so beautiful, but then it became more hectic because now she is looking at me like this is the father of my child i was messing up i didn't have a female friend that i would just keep as a friend even in my mind even if nothing happened i was bad i was really bad i didn't realize how wrong it was in 2022 kaspar university and tobega celebrated the birth of their first child despite their relationship ending he has publicly expressed his gratitude towards tobega particularly for the positive influence she has had on his life he appreciates the effort and spiritual growth Tobega underwent, especially as they co-parent their child. I'm happy for Kaz. I hope Bolani will love and respect him. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter what others think, as long as he is happy. Another one went on to say, until Casper confirms this, I'm not saying anything. As for now, these are just rumors. Nobody has yet confirmed, so we're gonna just wait and see what's gonna happen on the 16th of March. But it is crucial to recognize that relationships' decisions are deeply personal. Casper's choice regarding whom he marries is based on his feelings experiences and what he believes is best for his future it is important to respect people's choices about their lives and relationships even if those choices might not align with our expectations relationships especially long-term ones are complex from the outside we can never fully understand the dynamics challenges or reason why relationships begin or end Casper and Tobega's decision to part ways doesn't necessarily diminish the bond they share as parents. People do grow 
they change and sometimes grow apart. It's important to accept that finding happiness or fulfillment often involves making difficult decisions, including ending relationships that no longer serve the well-being of those involved. As for me on my side, I really do not know if, how true this is, but if it is true, we wish Kaswang Invest all the best. That's all that we have for now. Until the next time, please do not forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Peace.